reacting to what the offense gave me, uh, recognizing formation, um, just things like that, uh, put my eyes in the right place. Okay, how did you feel like uh, the depth and the secondary kind of performed on that day? I think everybody did good. Everybody went out there and played hard. Um, everybody's confidence was there. I feel like, I mean, from my perspective, but uh, I, in my opinion, but um, people, they know what they got to get better at, so I can't be the one to say. How advantageous do you think this week will be going against another team in practices? Uh, it should be a good look. I mean, they got some good receivers, so it should be a good look for us to get us ready for the season. Anybody else? Cool. Yeah. Thanks, Trey. Yeah. I'm going to get you one more. Um, just getting more, like the second year start, uh, start to slow down a little bit, um, learning how to like watch film and stuff like that. And I'm just learning from my coaches for real. I had two. Yeah. What do you think is the biggest skill set that Tyler has to have? Uh, really just being aggressive and not reckless. Um, being able to catch the ball clean. And if you can, get some yards for the team and just, just really just get, get the ball to the offense. Um, really just, I've been, I've been doing it all my life. So, like I said, like I've been looked at as an underdog my whole life. So that chip my shoulders, like it's built in my shoulders. So I just come out here and just every day just know I can't, I can't do what other people do. I got to go harder because I know everybody under, uh, overlooking me. And so that's what I got to do and, and do for this team. Yeah, you came here on a tryout basis, right? Yeah, yes, sir. What was the feeling like when they told you they were going to bring you to camp? Uh, it was just a blessing, um, a blessing to be able to get a chance to come and show my talents, and it was, it was a blessing to, to get be on the team. Eric, you got the reputation when you were at Louisiana Lafayette of being the energy guy. You brought it every day in practice. I read about your energy level. Uh -huh. First of all, is that just who you are, and where does that energy energy, energy come from? No, nah, it's it, it just, it just who I am. Uh, I, I love football. I love playing football. So you got to have energy when you come out here playing football. You can't be dead. You can't be slouched over. You got to have energy because – the energy of you will pick up off everybody else. And so they'll get it, and they'll want to make plays and, and stuff like that. Your college teammates ever get annoyed at you because maybe you brought it a little too much in practice? Nah, nah, day? nah, they, they didn't. Because I, I had it off the field too, so I had it off the field with them, and I had it on the field, so they really liked what I was doing. So they 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 came behind me, and we all had injuries together. Give me an example. Of and play a lot of plays in the two minute that was coming up, and we did that. Yeah, we, we just think we did like five plays. It was tiring, but we we, we definitely responded. Yeah, yeah. What do you think? Uh, the reps start to pile up for the first team defense. Mm -hmm. <laughs> get a little bit more action, whether it be in the joint practices or in a game eventually. Oh yeah, definitely. Uh, last, it started last week. We got a lot of we got a lot of reps last week, and it was good work because we knew we weren't playing Saturday and stuff like that. So it, it'd be a good opportunity this weekend to go get the Vikings with the same amount of reps. See what we do there.